Hello everyone, this is Mrs Cartwright here from the Rockpool. I'm going to read you a lovely story about two friends called Ellie and Alvis. Ellie and Alvis were best friends. They both liked bananas. They both loved oranges. And they both loved, adored dancing under the light of the moon. Have one of my bananas, Ellie, said Alvis. Oh, thank you, Alvis, said Ellie, and do have some of mine. Can I peel your orange for you, Alvis? asked Ellie. Alvis bowed. As long as you let me give you the biggest slice, Ellie dear. How beautifully you dance, Ellie, said Alvis admiringly. Ellie smiled. How handsome you look when you twirl, Alvis. But then one day things went badly wrong. Ellie saw Alvis hiding a brown paper bag full of bananas behind a bush. And when she went to look for them later, they were gone. He must have eaten them all to himself, she thought. Alvis is greedy. Alvis saw Ellie placing a big string bag of oranges in the crook of a branch. And when he went to look for them, later they were gone. She must have eaten them all herself, he thought. Ellie is selfish. When they were dancing that night, Ellie was thinking so hard about bananas that she trod on Alvis's toes. Alvis was thinking so hard about oranges that he twirled too quickly and knocked Ellie over. Alvis, Ellie said as she picked herself up, I don't want to dance with you anymore. That's all right with me, Alvis said in a huffy voice. I don't want to dance with you either. Don't then, snapped Ellie. I won't, grumped Alvis. Ellie went off to be by herself under the coconut tree, and so did Alvis. They sat back to back, and they didn't say a word. Then, plop, a banana skin plopped onto Ellie's head. Splat, a half-sucked orange splattered onto Alvis's toes. Ellie and Alvis looked up, and they saw Mr and Mrs Monkey and seven little monkeys having a feast in the coconut tree. Those are my bananas, shouted Alvis. I bought them as a present for Ellie. And those are my oranges, yelled Ellie. I bought them as a present for Alvis. Finders, keepers, shouted the rude little monkeys, and they threw banana skins and orange peel all over Ellie and Alvis. Oh, Alvis, said Ellie, I'm so sorry. I thought you'd eaten all those bananas yourself. Oh no, Ellie, Alvis said, they were all for you. He waggled his trunk and went rather pink. I'm sorry too. I thought you'd eaten all those oranges. Ellie gazed at him adoringly. They were all for you, dear Alvis, she said. Ellie, said Alvis, let's dance. Alvis, said Ellie, I will dance with you forever and ever and ever. Sometimes they stopped dancing to eat a banana or two, or an orange, and they always made sure their bananas and oranges were very safe. Or did they? Well... Keep safe, everybody, and I'm sure I'll reach you again soon.